Hello guys, Rachel here from Archaeologist Gaming. Today, we're gonna do the short unboxing, assembly, and reviewing the Deepcool AS500 Air Cooler. Let's do the unboxing! Inside the box, you will find a small box where you can find inside are the screws, the brackets, both for AMD and Intel, a fan controller, two extra fan brackets, the user's manual, the thermal paste, and lastly, the AS500 air cooler itself. Let's go to the specifications and features. The AS500 has a length of 142mm, a width without the fan of 48 millimeters, a height of 164 millimeters, and weighs at 1,030 grams. The cooler is simple looking and has a relatively dense fin stack with 56 aluminum fins. Below, you will see five copper heat pipes with 6 millimeters diameter, which is capable of handling up to 220 watts TTP. This cooler has a nickel plated base. The bundle fan, namely the TF140S PWM fan, has 500 to 1200 RPM range, but delivers a silent operation with 70.81 CFM of airflow. The fan also uses a fluid dynamic bearing. To add a modern twist to the design, Deepcool added a black top plate with ARGB LEDs hidden underneath. So, the RGB will not be over the top or annoying to other users. Let's assemble the cooler. Assembling the cooler was easy and people who are new to PC building will appreciate how fast and easy to assemble this air cooler. You just need a screwdriver and a manual, then you are good to go. Memory clearance is not a problem as what promised by Deep Cool. There's no blockage of the RAM slot so high clearance RAMs are good to go for the build. But you need to be aware for your expansion slot clearance because it will probably block your first slot. If you are using an older platform or ITX, you should check it every time before choosing this cooler. Here are the temperature results. Here are my final thoughts. The Deepcool AS500 is simple and minimalistic with a well thought design. It delivers a solid performance with low noise levels even at full load. The memory clearance and also the quick installation or assembly of the air cooler makes this a great deal. But there are problems which I think can be easily solved, like the clearance for beefy or big graphics cards. Next, the high clearance because some of the cases doesn't have a big clearance for air coolers. And lastly, the lighting may not be tasteful for everyone. Some people love less to no RGB and some wants more RGB. The AS500 is standing between that. So if you want to have more RGB, you can change your fans to RGB fans. If not, then stay with the bundle TF140S. Either way, these are the things the user should keep in mind. 
Overall, the cooler is a solid mid-range cooler, which is really appealing with a solid performance, with a good pricing. With that said, this cooler is easy to recommend. You can buy the Deepcool AS500 at a suggested retail price of 3,999 pesos at your nearest computer stores. I hope this video is informational for you. For more videos, click on the subscribe button and follow my Facebook page. And see you in the next video.